Hey guys, let us tour my baby's room. It is continuously a work in progress. I think it can still be a bit more personalized. We have not printed a single photo, so that is still to be done. But I thought, why don't I take you around and you can see some of the cool little things that we got for baby's room. So let's start here on the floor. This is a door stop. It actually holds the door open. Um, elephants are baby's animal. I just sensed that a lot when I was pregnant. This is nice and heavy and I got it from Checkers, right? Uh, I saw it, I wasn't even looking for it, and I thought this is so perfect as a doorstop. Then, this is a laundry basket. I'll be honest, I did look for an elephant, but didn't find an elephant, so we went with the lion raw. This was ordered from Take A Lot. I can't recall the price, to be honest with you, but it was very, very reasonable. Um, we kind of always were throwing babies laundry into the basket in the bathroom, but I was like, nah, let's get something for his room. Now it comes to part of his changing station. So the great thing about this, this is a Carowell uh, linen saver. I think it's called a linen saver because boys and girls, they wee when you change their diapers. But what I'm gonna show you about this, which is so cool. We got this from Baby City. The brand is Chico is that this is actually what you will see it's a bath it is a whole bath and you can fill it up you can disconnect the bath from the stand um and the stand also has holders on the side so you can put the baby's toiletries it's got a pipe so that you can drain it into a bucket and we're not using it at the moment because he's always kicking and splashing water everywhere so now he just baths in the bathroom so we use this fully as a changing station which i suspect he's gonna also outgrow soon because he's a busy body but it's got ample space very convenient easy to move easy to fold up up here we already spoke about the decor pieces these are from ma petite and i just um you know chantal did a lovely job uh, who happens to be my art director on Unpacked came to help me out with the room and she found these frames which I think fit perfectly with the different colored elephants. This is um, a compactum that we got from Diskem Baby City. It's now called Diskem Baby City. It's not just Baby City and because we opted for white it actually makes it easy if you if you're opting for white to pair different furniture pieces because the cot or the crib and the compactum are not from the same place. Uh, painted the wall this color, which funny enough, before we moved here, this was the same color as his room, but it was small and we couldn't do half the things we wanted to do, hence we're only showing the room now. But decor pieces from Ma Petite. And then what we decided to do with the wall, this is actually the same color he had in his previous room uh, where we used to stay um, but we couldn't do much in the in the in the place so we're only showing the the room now because now it's actually done work in progress done but this deco piece is all from my petite and this beautiful it's like between a royal blue and a navy blue color his crib uh we ordered this on take a lot yeah ordered this on take a lot but what i love about it is that the bed part the part where the mattress is on you can lift it to be super high you can lower it to be super low so it can actually go a level below this and then these can also come out when he grows up and he can basically have a mini single bed for himself so it's really nice when buying stuff for baby to make sure that you buy things that he can grow into and not like having to keep changing um, all the things that you're buying for him. So on the side of the room, hmm, this stand, you won't believe, but when I was living in Norwood in a small house, um, I didn't have space for pots and pans. So that's where the pots and pans stayed. And then um, every time I moved house, it had a completely different function. At some point, it was for toiletries in my room. But then we decided, why don't we use this for baby's toys in his room? Because it fits his colors of the white and gray. So it's just a stand 
where all his toys fit in there. Um, you'll see there's a lamp <laughs> there because load shedding. <laughs> but his toys come from a variety of places. I think we'll do a video talking about his toys and why some of them have been chosen because they're supposed to be educational. Some of them are musical toys. But we'll have a, a chat about that in another video. Uh, I'm going to show you the heater because I find that the oil thin heaters sort of retain the heat the best. Um, it's not like a bar heater that dries the air easily ordered from take a lot this little table it's literally a fold out picnic table i think got it waste pack um at some point when i had baby there was just no space for a lot of things and this was used to help me record my voiceovers and now it's in baby's room because it was just convenient to have the space a little humidifier from take a lot this VTEC, uh, VR Tech, sorry, baby monitor is from Diskin Baby City. Diffuser with, uh, uh, is from Take A Lot. Diffuser oils from Goodnight Baby. If I bring you down here, we have a humidifier. Got that at Diskim a long time ago. You can see it's a Vicks brand, but what I like about it, you can pour oils into it to diffuse the room. But we keep, um, because he's had sinus issues, we keep the room quite moist. The rocking chair, uh, along with its matching footstool, are from CSI Studio. Shout out to you guys for hooking us up. Very handy. Even now that baby's a bit bigger, it's still very useful. And then the elephant. The elephant is from his uncle and his aunt. That matches with his cousin, my niece. And I'm not sure where, where they got it, but I know that they sell them as well on Take A Lot. Then I want you to look down to this rug. How cute! The entire alphabet, so adorable. I ordered this on Take A Lot. I've seen it on other baby sites, but it was just convenient to get everything from one place. So that was quite handy. Um, and then one more thing that I want to show you as part of his tour. During the day, <clears throat> when we take his toys out and he plays, we open up this mat. It's so nice when you travel or you want to be outside. It still opens. On one side, it's got all the pictures. And on the other side, it's got alphabet and words. Very handy, nice material. It's like waterproof. Um, but this gets taken out like if let's say we're busy with other things and he needs to play on the floor then this is handy and sorted for him so that's the tour of the room guys I'm sure it's not the last time we're going to do a room tour for Mugotlechi because he's growing and it continuously changes we still want to put pictures up on the wall make it a bit more personal and be warned this is how the room looks because we cleaned it up under normal circumstances there are toys everywhere there are a million things everywhere because it's a baby's room or a kid's room but i hope you enjoyed comment down below let me know what you think maybe there's a specific thing that you like oh i like that or have you tried that let me know